Um, okay, so let's just settle into a nice, comfortable seated posture. And well done, you two who were <clears throat> in the a mindfulness. Uh, oh, and Shayla, but Shayla was a little, had stuff going on in the background there quite a bit. And thanks for popping in, Lou, at the end. So um, good on you guys for doing yet another session of meditation. <laughs> so uh, let's just settle into a nice, comfortable seated posture. And just try and um, bring your mind to the same place your body is. Shoulders aligned with the hips and the ears aligned with the shoulders. And now just imagine your spine is this beautiful string of pearls of light that stretch from the base all the way up through the crown of the head and beyond. And just really lengthen your spine. And then go to the crown of the head and just notice if you can feel any sensation there. It doesn't matter if there's none. Relax the forehead and the eyes, the nose, the cheeks, the mouth, the jaw, back of the tongue. And just feel some softness coming into your face. Relax the back of the head, the back of the neck. Allow your shoulder blades and shoulders to drop down. <coughs> Allow some softness into your throat, your chest and belly and all of your limbs and your extremities, your hands and feet and fingers and toes. And just notice the air as you're inhaling and exhaling through the nostrils. Just tune in to any sounds in your environment. Allow the sounds to be there. And just try not to follow them with the mind. Let them be. And then notice what is arising in the mind. So some of you may have had some things happen today that are on your mind. So just allow them to arise and abide. And just try and release with the breath the exhale, anything that is no longer really serving you, anything that doesn't serve you, that maybe just the only serving it's doing is agitating the mind. So just as you exhale, just let go of all of that. And then take a step back and just look at the mind with some level of objectivity. Try not to get all involved in the story. And bring to mind now all your people of your life, your loved ones, friends, family, if they're in the friend category, and then the strangers all around, and then the ones you don't like so much or just find irritating. And remember that they can, these relationships can change place at any time due to the impermanent nature of this world in which we live. And they're all equal in their wish to be happy, they wish to be free from suffering and having this extraordinary capacity for Buddhahood. So we think, you know, we do this meditation for all these people of our life and for, you know, people here and there, you know, again, Don's mother who passed uh, yesterday, day before, and then will to continue his healing journey. And there may 
maybe other people in your own life. Just can imagine them sitting here with us doing the meditation or um, imagine sending all the, that you're doing this meditation for them. So we think there is no negativity that can't be purified. And this uh, purification process is basically a psychological one. We create negativity with our mind, so equally we can change that by creating positivity instead. So we start with the power of regret. So sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you have done to harm any living being on this day, in this life, and in all of our past lives. And you can think of specific actions of both your body and your speech and then in general, regret all. And the reason to regret is based on this logic of karma. And we experience everything due to our past karma, our past actions, and having harmed others, we ourselves will necessarily experience suffering in the future. We cannot bear the thought of any future suffering that we might experience. As we know from our present suffering, we don't want any more. So logically, it makes sense to remove those karmic seeds before they ripen as future suffering for us. So think like this. I regret from the depths of my heart having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows because I do not want the future suffering. I'm sick of suffering and also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others. And then think again, I'm sick of this suffering. And then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here we come to the power of reliance as two little sections, one on refuge and one on developing compassion. So we start with refuge. So imagine um, we have this beautiful Buddha Vajrasattva. We're relying on Vajrasattva, who we see as a doctor rather than somebody that's going to forgive us. And we imagine Vajrasattva above the crown of your head. And you can also imagine this is the mind of your teacher manifesting in this form for your benefit. <clears throat> He's made of radiant, blissful white light, sitting cross-legged on a white lotus and a moon cushion, and uh, has a beautiful radiant face. His eyes are long and peaceful and full of love and compassion for you and all those people of your life. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. His arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right, the left is holding a bell representing wisdom and the right is holding a vajra which represents the indestructibility of compassion and their being crossed represents the union of these two and this symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. To the Buddha, the Dharma and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened by this practice of meditating on Guru Vajrasattva, may I reach Buddhahood so as to benefit all sentient beings. So in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings, the very beings we have harmed and those who have harmed us, by developing compassion for them. So think particularly of people you may have harmed recently and in the past, and then in general, all beings we have ever harmed since beginning this time. And then remember those who have harmed you and have compassion for them because the harm they've caused you is going to result as suffering for them in the future. So make a strong aspiration to do this practice of purification for the sake of all these beings and think I must purify for their sake. And now we come to the power of the remedy and this is the medicine doing the practice of purification and we start with the body and Vajrasattva very compassionately sends powerful white nectar like coming out of a hose, quite forcefully from his heart. It arcs around and enters your crown and pours into your entire body, filling you completely. And it keeps pouring into you until it forces out of your lower orifices all the harm you have ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid. And this pours out of you and it disappears into space, not one atom left as we recite the mantra. Om Bajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Bajrasafa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutukaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sitame Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tatagata Vajra Mamimutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Saka Ah Hum Pei 
Vajrasapa Samayam Nupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anorecta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shiyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hompe Vajrasapa Samayam Nupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa and erecta me boa, sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, sitam shiyam kuru hum ha ho bago and sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. And vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita, dida me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, and erecta me boa, sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bago an sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. An vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita diru me boa sitokaya me boa sipokaya me boa anorecta me boa sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me. Sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bago an sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorecta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bago An Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satra A Hum Pe Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorecta me boa, sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bago an sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya satwa a hum pe. So be delighted that all the harm you've done to any sentient being with your body is now completely purified and think that there's no way you could do anything but benefit others now with your body. Next is a purification of our speech, and Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra, and this arcs around and quite forcefully enters your crown and fills your entire body, except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech. And this overflows and disappears into space, not one atom left. So just imagine all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying and talking badly about others behind their backs, all of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you as we recite the mantra. Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorecta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shiyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anorecta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shiyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe And Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bago an sawa tata gata vajrama me mutta vajrabawa maha samaya sata a hum pe. An vajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita, dira me boa, sitokaya me boa, sipokaya me boa, anorecta me boa, sawa sidi me piyata sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhago An Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe An Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Me Piyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhago An Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sata A Hum Pe and Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Me Boa Sitokaya Me Boa Sipokaya Me Boa Anorecta Me Boa Sawa Sidi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me 
Sitam Shiyam Guru Hum Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajama Mimutsa Vajabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Humpe Ambadra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shiyam Guru Hum Ha Ha Ho Bhagavan Sawatata Gata Vajama Mimutsa Vajabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Hum so again, feel so happy that your speech is now completely purified. And really imagine it's not possible to do anything other than benefit others now with your speech. So every single syllable that falls out of your mouth is going to be a benefit to the other, including yourself, because you also hear it. So next is the purification of our mind and Vajrasattva very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So just imagine uh, you walk into a pitch black room, you flick on that switch and the light that comes instantly dispels the darkness in the room. And we just take it for granted that we can walk into a room and switch on a light and that the light will come and that the darkness goes. And it happens so fast, we don't kind of ever break it down unless we have a power outage. And it's like, why are you not working? But here in this case, you imagine from Vajrasattva's heart, light comes. And, you know, the moment that light from Vajrasattva's heart touches your heart chakra, all the darkness of the negativity of your mind, so all your attachment and depression and anxiety and bitterness and grudges, all of this instantly dispelled. Not one atom left as we recite the mantra again. Am Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Situkaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sata A Humpe and Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawasidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Sata A Humpe And Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira meboa, sitokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa, anarakta meboa, sawasidi mimpi yatta sawa kama sita me, sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama mimutsa vajrabawa mahasamaya sata a humpe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, dira meboa, sitokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa, Anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yatta sawa kama sita me, sitam shiyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan, sawa tata gata vajrama mimutsa vajrabawa mahasamaya satra a humpe, and vajrasapha samaya manupalaya vajrasapha dina patita, dira meboa, sitokaya meboa, sipokaya meboa, anarakta meboa, sawa sidi mimpi yatta sawa kama sita me, Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Humpe And Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satra A Humpe and Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dira Meboa Sitokaya Meboa Sipokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutsa Vajrabawa Mahasamaya Satva A Hum Pe So again, be delighted that all your delusions which are the source of all of our own suffering and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech are completely purified. And now imagine there's no space in your heart for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. 
And now is the purification of even the imprints of negativity of the body, speech, and mind. And this time, imagine Vajrasattva sending light and nectar. It fills you completely and eradicates even the very subtle imprints of this negative energy, our habit energies. Vajrasattva Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasattva Dinapatita Dira Mebawa Sutukaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anarakta Mebawa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe Vajrasattva Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasattva Dinapatita Dira Mebawa Sutukaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anarakta mebowa sawa sidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajrama mimutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe ambhajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita dira mebowa sutukaya mebowa sipokaya mebowa anarakta mebowa sawa sidi mempi yatta sawa kama sita me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe Ambhajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Situkaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anurakta Mebawa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sitta Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe and Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Situkaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anarakta Mebawa Sawa Sidi Mimpi Yatta Sawa Kama Sitta Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe And Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dira Mebawa Situkaya Mebawa Sipokaya Mebawa Anarakta mebowa sawa sidi mimpi yatta sawa kama sita me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajrama mimutta vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe ambhajrasapa samaya manupalaya vajrasapa dina patita dira mebowa situkaya mebowa sipokaya mebowa anarakta mebowa sawa sidi mimpi yatta sawa kama sita me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Mimutta Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe So now feel completely purified. There's not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. Even the subtlest obscurations to your enlightenment have been removed. So now we come to the power of resolve, and this is the fourth and final step in the purification process, and yet a really crucial one. So here we make a determination to refrain from harming with our body and our speech and our mind. And so without making a determination, without deciding that we're going to do something, excuse me, we're just going to keep doing the same old things over and over again. So this determination becomes like an aspiration. And it's a beacon that guides our body and our speech and our mind in new directions. So it becomes like guardrails for us. Oh, I made this promise to myself. I made a decision. It's almost like a decision is almost like a vow. Decided, I'm not going to harm. So once all the little beings in the forest realize that you're not going to harm them, this is my experience up here, they just get pretty relaxed. I don't get too close. Somehow they know. And so people know as well. People know whether they're safe with you, whether you're a safe person, whether you're emotionally safe, physically safe. People pick it up subliminally. And you want to be safe for yourself as well. You want to be your own best friend, your own, your own support. 
So think of rejoicing in your efforts. All this time you've been coming night after night. All our, all our hosts coming night after night. Amazing. And then think of something you'd like to work on over the weekend. Keep it simple, keep it light. And this determination to not do again, to not harm or to refrain from harming gives us some kind of, well, like I said, a guardrail, but it gives us a little bit of strength to try and do something different. So Vajrasattva, imagine, is delighted with us and wants to merge with your mind and he melts into white light and absorbs into you through your crown and think... My teacher's body, speech, and mind, and Vajrasattva's body, speech, and mind, and my own body, speech, and mind are the same. So next, Rinpoche used to recommend to meditate on emptiness, and he would say, in emptiness there is no I, the creator of negative karma, there is no action of creating negative karma, and there is no negative karma created. So at what a level, whatever level you understand emptiness, place your mind there for a little while. We can think of all phenomena as being empty, they do not exist from their own side. We can also think that the way things appear to me may not necessarily be the way they actually exist. So let's just dedicate all the merit, all the positive energy we've created doing this practice to all living beings and think, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. So let's do our three verses of uh, chanting the names of Manjushri, the best embodiment of every Buddha with eyes, the joy of every living being, creator manifesting varied forms, great sage deserving praise, deserving worship, a mantrin born unto the triple family, upholding mantras of the foremost pledge, the greatest bearer of the triple gem who teaches all three peerless vehicles. With snare unfailing, most victorious, the snatcher ever great, the Vajra snare, the Vajra hook, the snare of excellence. Okay, everybody. So let's just dedicate for the long life of His Holiness the Dalai Lama and for the swift return of Lama Zoparimbashe and for all of your own very precious teachers. So on Sunday morning, I'm doing a meditation and Tai Chi Cho practice through Land of Medicine Buddha. So you're very welcome to check it out and come along if you wish. I'd love to see some of you there have already started a little bit of Tai Chi Cho. And um, I'm, I'm going to be on Zoom this weekend. So that is a long drive from here, so I, I can't do it every week. <laughs> it took me about two weeks to recover from the last one. On oh, no, a week to recover from the last one. <laughs> anyway, all right, you guys, lots of love. Have a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you on Monday. If oh no, Monday I won't see you. I am on retreat on Monday. I need to tell Venerable Dundrup. So, will you guys lead the practice yourselves? Yes. Okay. Cool. Happy to. All right. Okay. Cool. All right. So then I'll see you Tuesday morning, if I don't see some of you on Sunday. All right. Lots of love, everybody. Thank you so much. Bye. Good night. Thank you.